hi guys welcome to my youtube channel today in this video i am going to discuss about the culvert design and the stone pitching work you may see here that the water is flowing and due to the improper designing of box culvert erosion had taken place similarly you may also see that the stone pitching work has also been spoiled here as such, designing is a very important part of box culvert. Similarly, proper materials have to be used in order to avoid such kind of problems. So you may see here that we are doing the construction of culvert here. First of all, we had to construct the base. Now we are constructing the walls. Here we are expecting a large flow of water. This is the reason why a proper construction of culvert was done before you start constructing a culvert it is always advised to study the area the cross-sectional area from where water is flowing can be studied so that it can give you an idea on how to construct and design your culvert after the construction is done you may also see that the proper backfilling was done if the backfilling is not done properly and retaining walls are not constructed then it is obvious that you will have erosion of soil. So apart from the construction of box culvert, let me emphasize you upon the construction of jewels and stone pitching. Earlier in the video you had seen how the stone pitching work was spoiled due to lack of compaction and the improper usage of materials. Whenever you are doing the stone pitching work, a tow beam can be provided at the toe of your embankment. It will give support to the base of your embankment and the water could be flowed easily without tempering your stone pitching work. So guys, I hope you liked today's video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Until my next video, goodbye.